Hey house guests, welcome to today's BB12 Daily Spoiler. Our house guest of the day is Miss Murder Says. So, last night, Lane won part two of the final HOH during the live show, and now Enzo is pretty sure he's going home because either Hayden or Lane are going to win the final HOH, and they're pretty much both set on taking each other to the final two. So Enzo is probably right in this situation for once. So Big Brother rewarded the final three with the catered dinner with music. So that was nice of them. I think they had lobster. And um, Enzo has been awfully quiet since last night. What happened to the great social game player, the best in the game ever? Seriously, he's like, his social game is obviously over. <laughs> um, he's like, I miss my wifey and baby Gia. So yeah, he's ready to go. But unfortunately, he's going to have to wait until finale night. And um, I wouldn't be surprised if the diary room kind of pushed him to campaign a little bit more so he's not just like sitting around moping for the rest of the week. But um, I don't know WTF they're going to do until the finale because the final part of the HOH competition is during the live finale. So, I mean, what are they going to do this whole time? I don't know. But... Um, they did give them a football, so I guess that'll keep them occupied for a while. So since there's nothing else going on in the house, let's talk about my day. So this morning I had an orthodontist appointment at 9.30, which was one of the main reasons I came home this weekend. Also, tomorrow's my sister's birthday, so I'm home for that. But, um, I got the molds done for my retainer because I'm getting my braces off next time. And... There's only one way to put it. I threw up on myself. Um, can I get any more classy and attractive? Seriously, that is like the epitome of class. But yeah, I just couldn't take it. Like, if you've ever gotten molds done for braces or for retainers, you know, like first they put in the trays to see if they'll even fit right um, before they even put in the molds. So I was okay during that, and I was okay even during the bottom one with the gel or whatever. But then when they, when they got to the top one, I was like, uh-uh. So that stuff, it was disgusting. It was squishy. It was like hitting the back of my tongue, and I was freaking out. And then all of a sudden, there was puke coming out of my mouth. And I don't know what happened, but somehow, miraculously, I didn't get anything on my clothes, which was a miracle. Those bibs that they give you are, like, hardcore. But anyway, um, it was a little bit... Uh, humbling. It was a humbling experience throwing up in the orthodontist's office. So yeah, <laughs> um, that was fun. And um, my braces could be coming off in two weeks because that's how long it takes for them to get the retainer. But unfortunately, I have to wait like two and a half months because I can't come home again until Thanksgiving, which sucks, which means Black Friday, these bad boys are coming off. Okay. So, as a little treat for throwing up on myself, um, and also because I didn't have breakfast, which was a good thing because that would have been really scary if I had, um, I got rewarded with these at Target. Ah! I love soft baked cookies, and Pepperidge Farm is the shiz. So, that was really exciting. And also for lunch today, I had what we call special sandwich. Special sandwich. Um, and it's. Swiss and provolone with spinach and artichoke dip in between the two slices of cheese, all on a Kaiser roll. This is like my favorite lunch, and I don't get it at school, so whenever I'm home, I have to have it, and it was amazing, and yeah. Other highlights of the day, spending time with the puppies and the new cats, which is fun to get to know them, so I'm glad that I could see them in their first week at home. And um, that's pretty much it. So I'll have some more spoilers for you tomorrow. And until then, much love.